guys, I hope you enjoyed that little video that I just put together. Um, I know that that was a video that was a long time in the making in reality, even though it was kind of short. Um, it was a really awesome experience. New Haven is a place in New Haven that what you do is you pay about $12. You get to go into an area where they have a bunch of cats and all the cats that you are seeing and being able to play with are all up for adoption at the time that you're actually going in there. For a set fee, there's one fee for like all the cats. Oh, I forgot about that. So that's good to know. Um, and then you can actually be able to play with the cats and interact with the cat that you're looking to adopt if you want. Or you can just go in there and like read a book and have cats like hang out with you or play with the cats or... They have crippled cats too. At the time they had one of the crippled cats, yeah. And it's just a really cool organization. It's a really cool place to go and take a visit. I know that the cat cafe thing is becoming a little bit more popular in the U.S. right now. I would say from our first experience, it was awesome. It was well really worth clean. It. Super clean. Like was, I'm allergic to cats, but I couldn't even tell that there was like 17 cats or whatever. Yeah, at the time I think there was 17 and the place was so clean, so nice. Staff was really kind. Um, cats were absolutely adorable. We had a great time. Um, and they don't, they give you, they say like you, you're there for like two hours or something, but they don't like rush you out. Like you don't we feel like you have the time. Yeah, you can sign up for two hours, but we were only there for an hour. And like Vic said, it was not rushed. We didn't have, we didn't feel the pressure to have to leave or anything like that. So I, I really enjoyed my experience. I, I think that we're probably gonna end up going again at some point. It was a great time. What would you say about the place? I really liked it. It was clean. The animals were friendly. The people were nice. Yeah, so if it's you... pretty big too. So even if there is like other people there, you can still like do your own thing. Yeah, they even sell a couple drinks and food items that you can bring in with you. And like I said, I really enjoyed it personally. I would, I have recommended it to my friends since we've gone, and I would like to go again. Even though we're about to bring home the kitty. Yeah, even though we're on adoption number two at the moment. So, if you're in the New Haven area, I highly recommend you take a visit down there. Um, great date night thing to do. Great little small activity to do. And if you adopt, you're helping a great cause. If you're just going to visit, all the money goes to helping getting those cats new food, toys, um, and even that helps them because it's rather it's socializing rather than just sitting in a cage somewhere. Yeah, and that's a huge, that's definitely a huge thing is that you really get to see the personality of your cat before you adopt the cat, which is fantastic. So like I said, if you're in the area, definitely check out New Haven. I'll be putting the link to their website down below, so be sure to check them out. Um, if they have any social media links at this time, I'll also be putting I think that they down have below. An Instagram. Awesome. So I'll be I'll try to put that down below for you guys as well. And I hope you enjoyed this. Be sure to share this with your friends, especially if they're trying to adopt a cat. And leave a comment down below telling me what kind of cat you like, or if you're a cat person or a dog person. Uh, I'd be interested to figure out who out there is cat people opposed to dog people. But anyways, I hope you guys have a good t have a good night and hopefully you stick around for the next video. Thanks and have a good one.